Curtis Cherry is a production associate at Goodwill's store in Milford, where he works every day sorting and stocking wares on the sales floor. Referred to Goodwill by the Division of Vocational Rehabilitation in 2009, Curtis has made tremendous progress in becoming an independent, productive member of the Goodwill team. However, the early years for Curtis proved to be difficult for him and his family. Growing up, Curtis's military family often moved around. While living overseas, they continually struggled to find assistance for his special needs and sought a transfer back to the States. I started noticing some things about Curtis. I didn't think he was talking or walking at the time frame he should have been. And my pediatrician decided that he was developmentally delayed, so he needed to be in their developmentally delayed preschool. After about two weeks, the teacher of the preschool called me in for a conference and told me she'd been teaching for about 12 years and she didn't feel it was just developmental delay. She felt it was either autism or fragile X syndrome, but they needed him to get a further evaluation. And since they didn't have the um, people there, they sent us to England to get an evaluation at the base hospital there and came back with the diagnosis of pervasive developmental delay, not otherwise specified, or PDD-NOS. I remember asking the pediatrician, what kind of services will he get with the diagnosis of PDD-NOS? And he said, nothing. And I said, well, what about with the diagnosis of autism? He says, well, most parents don't want that diagnosis because that's like a death sentence. I said, but will he get services with that? And he said, yes. I said, well, that's what he's got. The strain on the family wasn't just felt by the parents. His sister Angela said Curtis and his special needs had an impact on her as well. He started uh, the inappropriate play, the pulling hair and the kind of hitting and stuff. That's when I really started taking notice, like, okay, this just isn't he's shy or something. This is something totally different. So that's when I actually started listening to my mom then and realized what she was going through. Finally, they were granted the transfer that they had been hoping for and ended up in New Mexico. Still, the help that Curtis needed wasn't close by. He ended up being stationed in Clovis and having to travel four hours at least once or twice a month so he could see a developmental pediatrician, a developmental psychologist. Through it all, the family stuck together and eventually moved to Delaware where they began to find a sense of peace. That's when things began to change. As a young adult, Curtis tried working other jobs without success until he started with Goodwill. He just couldn't speak well and you had to make sure that you talk to him, enunciate your words, and make sure he understood you. He didn't talk in complete sentences then, and he was very shy, really, really shy. As a member of the Goodwill family, Curtis was accepted, given structure, and allowed to grow. Today, he enjoys his work and especially likes to play practical jokes on his coworkers. I like playing tricks on coworkers, spider, a big, a big spider on co-workers, co-workers scared, they'd scream a little, I would laugh. He wasn't as shy anymore. Uh, he did, you know, talk to us, tell us what his needs were. He wasn't one word answers anymore. He would talk in complete sentences, in paragraphs. He would actually come up to you and engage in conversation, tell you how he is and what he's done the day before or that weekend that he was off. And we don't even have to prompt him, ask him, or guide him. He just jumps in and does whatever needs to be done. And I mean, from him being someone that had to be job coached and had to stand beside him and help him for the first year, he's just, he's, he's come a long way. Everybody was so polite, so pleasant, and so willing to show him what he needed to do to be successful at the job. We were at um, Texas Roadhouse for a birthday dinner and two girls passed by, hi Curtis, hi Curtis. And I said, who's that? It's my coworkers. The Roth Achievement Award being presented to Curtis Cherry is named after Delaware Senator William Roth, a pioneer in advancing the rights of people with disabilities 
and an early advocate of the Americans with Disabilities Act. The award recognizes the goodwill employee who has demonstrated that integrated employment promotes self-esteem and good job performance. For Curtis Cherry, being a part of the Goodwill family has made a tremendous difference in his life and that of his family.